together. We beat one together, they cannot stop us. They can't score on us, defense. What's the team beat the ass teams? Win on three. We gonna win together. We win together. Win on three. One, two, three. Win. Today we're going to talk about two deserving Ring of Honor inductees. First up, the man in the trenches, the best right tackle in the history of the franchise. Willie Anderson starts with his feet, size 18 Triple E, but he had sweet feet. He could move those feet now, and then he'd roll, snap those hips. He had that powerful core. And then once you got those big muckers on you, those hands on you and controlled you, it was over. Big Willie was as dominant a right tackle as there was of his era and equally dominant in pass protection and run blocking. Some guys are good run blockers but can't pass pro, and vice versa, Willie could do it all. Let's take a look at this guy. The first thing about Willie Anderson, leadership. Didn't say much, but when he talked, people listen, man. He was EF Hutton. Willie Anderson was the man. In the running game, nobody was better. Look at the lane he made for Corey Dillon. Corey Dillon loved Willie Anderson, and they would load the box with seven, eight players, Corey Dillon still set records running the football. Here comes Big Willie around the horn. Huh? Huh? That's a big man in front of Corey Dillon. Look at that block against the Pittsburgh Steelers hooking that linebacker. That's a bad day for that linebacker when you see Big 71 coming around the corner with a full head of steam. And Corey Dillon against division rival opponents always had big days, and Willie Anderson was a big part of it. Willie's widening the, the hole, fullback leading. Corey Dillon seeing the gaping hole. Off to the races goes Dillon. Big time, Whew, a lot of green right there. And it all starts with Willie Anderson in the trenches and working against Michael Strahan, a Hall of Famer himself. Michael Strahan says that Willie Anderson deserves to be in the Hall of Fame. Good enough for me, case closed. Willie Anderson, not only Ring of Honor, Hall of Famer. What a pair, Willie Anderson up front, getting it done in the trenches and a playmaker, Isaac Curtis, getting it done on the perimeter. This guy was an Olympian. He made the Olympics, decided to focus on football. World-class speed. Not a track guy trying to play football. He was a football player that could fly. And man, did he have sticky fingers. Let's take a look at what Isaac Curtis is all about. This guy averaged 17 yards plus per catch for his career, not for a season. He had multiple seasons where he averaged over 20 yards a catch, over 17 yards a catch for his entire career. Come on, man. This guy was the real deal. And play action pass, this is a drop back for Ken Anderson. And he hits, look at, watch Isaac Curtis. Make the catch between multiple defenders. Watch the fun start, yards after catch. Get north and south. Man, make another guy miss. Square your shoulder pads up and get to the end zone. That is an unbelievable play. Took apart the Houston Oilers. Ooh, double spike right there. Double over the head back, <laughs> back spike for Isaac Curtis right there, his signature mark. And this is a... Uh, against the Cleveland Browns. He owned the Cleveland Browns. The Browns, oh, feared Isaac Curtis. Look at that one-handed fingertip catch. And then it's not over, it's just starting. Here he goes again, off to the races. Look at that stride, Olympic speed stride on, on Isaac Curtis. This guy was unbelievable. Little play action pass here against the Detroit Lions. Kenny Anderson, oh, look at that parabola. High arcing ball, contested catch. Off the, off the defensive back's helmet. He interfered with Isaac Curtis, still didn't make any difference. Makes the catch, big play. All right, here are the Oilers, rush three and drop eight. We're not gonna let Isaac Curtis beat us deep. Oh yeah? And Anderson says, I see eight five, one on one. I'm going there. Contested catch, makes the play. Nobody can cover Isaac Curtis one on one. Big time playmaker, ring of honor, well-deserved. He should be in the Hall of Fame as well. Let's get it done.